Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex of Corbin. Hold on, I need to make... <laughs> Two times things, simply trolls with the gums are like, button. And welcome back to this part... Episode two. No, part two. Right. Well, I guess technically part it two. It is. It is part uh, two, episode, episode two. Episode two of Guns and Number Clubs. two. Uh, if you haven't seen the first episode, uh, please go watch that. Yes. Uh, if you're watching... You shouldn't YouTube, watch number two without going number one. you're seeing this on YouTube. You're going to see a very cut-up version, just like the first episode. You could use about five to ten minutes of each episode. If you'd like to see the full uncut episodes, you can go to Patreon. I'll Where you can in the look comment. in our pants. And this episode is called... Episode two. Episode two is called Everything I Do, I Do It For You. I expect we'll get some Brian Adams music in this one. Sing that song. You know it's true. Everything I, Everything I do. Oh, I do it for you. And you need to have that raspy, smoky. But you don't, so. No, I do not have raspy, smoky. I'm far more in the clarity of Paul McCartney than the raspy of Rod Stewart. Wow, that's... Full of yourself. I was talking about clarity. I sound like Paul McCartney. I was talking about clarity of tone. I'm going to go ahead and say Not quality of don't. voice. Here we go. Well, up your butt, up your butthole. They had put sunglasses on him. D. Oh my word. <laughs> You probably shouldn't have wrapped him if you. I know. If you wanted to... it to look like it was a motorcycle accident, Granted, maybe they weren't. Granted, he was stabbed. So. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. Lovely. Lovely makeup. Love that mullet. What are you going to do here? What is it? Tell me. What do you want to meet with him? Call this number. You don't think you look at the face of the face. You don't think you look at the face of the face. बताइए क्या कर सकता हूँ आपके लिए 
यही तो हम आपसे पूछने आए हैं मतलब अर्जुन जी गुलाबगंज मेरे घर जैसा है और इस घर में आप मेरे मेहमान हैं थैंक यू पर बाय गॉड्स ग्रेस सब सही है पर फिर भी कुछ भी चाहिए हो कुछ भी जैसे मतलब oh my God. लाइफ में ज्यादा कुछ नहीं चाहिए जो भी मिल जाता है उसी से खुश हो जाता हूं मैं तो एक्चुअली आपको एडवाइस दूंगा कि आपको भी ट्राई करना चाहिए क्या सिंप्लिसिटी सर आपने राय तो बहुत अच्छी दी अर्जुन जी पर बात क्या है घड़ा है ना पूरी तरह पक चुका है आप जिंदगी जीने की जो आदत लग गई है वो लग गई है आप ना हमारे शहर के सुप्रिंटेंडेंट ऑफ पुलिस मिश्रा जी से जरूर मिलिएगा वो भी जब आए थे ना तो उनकी भी जरूरतें बहुत कम थी पर पता नहीं बहन क्यों बाद में बढ़ती चली गई बढ़ती चली गई <laughs> एक नंबर की मादर चोरी और आदमी अच्छे मेरे दोस्त अगर कुछ काम के लिए फोन करते हैं तो मैं बोल देता हूँ मेरे से कुछ एक्सपेक्ट मत करो बहन चोदो सिर्फ किसी का दोस्त है रिश्तेदार नहीं मुझे लग रहा है इस लेटर में कुछ गड़बड़ है इतना तो गलत लिखता है लोलो का मर्डर हो गया ना मेरे हाथों कौन लोलो एक सेकेंड वो शेरपुर वाले उनको तुमने लाल की पेचक से नहीं मतलब वो आने से नाम क्या था टीपू किसी ने पूछा सागवान शीशम से महंगा होता है ना पर मजबूती भी दुगनी देता है था। पुलिस केस अगर ना ना मेरे ऊपर तो बहुत अच्छा हो जाएगा। Yeah, well the new head of the new sheriff in town is not going to be easy to buy out. Durgesh and Gangaram fail again. Don't laugh. Are you planning to stay here forever? Sit down. And now. Front of everybody. The topper is Chotsna Verma. Yeah, not a fan of that style of teaching. Lal Krishna, Jyotsna did not. Yeah, that's why they study so hard because the <laughs> they're humiliated in front of everybody. Yeah. Well done, Jyotsna. Thank you. Everyone, clap for her. I never got mad when I saw a paper Jyotsna. if somebody had an F. I was sad, and part of it, I thought, what did I do wrong? Please win the badge to her. It's all your fault, not mine. Yeah. Partly. I depends. Agree. Depends on the student. I agree. It's never my fault. Destroy him! Do 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 do. There's a pen for Topper. Really? Is this like a normal practice, or just this place? Tell me if that's true. Do they actually give the Topper a a badge? Now, see, Gachi Sir, how they will give him a badge. I'm telling you, my heart is broken. बात तो तुम्हारी सही है बे इसमें तो लोग लिखा ही नहीं पहले तो चार बार था इसमें तो खुशबू भी नहीं है कुछ तो गलत है मुझे इस लेटर में लिखे एक एक शब्द का सर वाह इंग्लिश की विशेषज्ञ से पढ़ना चाहिए बकवास आगे पर क्या लिखा है एक बहुत ही Yeah, worlds are gonna cross here at some point. मैंने जो 
Great sound continuity. Duk, 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 duk. We know that song. There it is. You will see what you mean to me. This will definitely get copyrighted. What movie was this in? Top Gun? Too hot! Robin Hood. The recent one? No, the Kevin Costner one. Take my life! Aww. Oh, that was really fast. <laughs> yep. You should probably get it checked before you give it to her this time, though. Yeah. Proofread that. Yeah. Oh, God. You didn't proof it, man. He's such a good listener, and I'm so glad they kept camera on him to watch him listening. Poor Tipu. Heck of a heck of a stash. Uh, and that's what they call blackmail. Oh, is your daughter gonna see it? Probably shouldn't have stepped out on your wife. Moral to the story. Don't cheat on your spouse. Only cheat on schoolwork, am I right? Yep. Don't hide anything from your spouse. Who took those photos? Is that the blackmail? Somebody was taking pictures of them? Yeah. Through the window or something? 
Or they hired a photographer, which would be weird for an affair. <laughs> uh, but it was high power photography spy. Is it Carl Egan? Me? I like her. I do too. Chadar bed sab soya. Hand to mouth. That's basically saying he doesn't use a fork. No, hand to mouth means you live paycheck to paycheck. Oh. Is that turn around? Yep. Because if she if he works for them, he'll make a lot of money. She that shallow? There's a lot of there's a lot of women that are turned on by that. That's why guys in the mob get wives, money, and the power. Yeah, I was gonna say, give us that clip again. That's great. That's it. Yeah, do me right now. There's Niagara Falls in there. It's weird. <laughs> She's a couple more murders and you might get lucky. Did you kill somebody today? Uh, yes. <laughs> I want to know more about I know. him. <laughs> I love the sound of coyotes. That means you have an alcohol problem. I think he's going to die soon. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yep. And he's going to And he's going to have to take over. He's gonna, oh, he's gonna fall straight cause, down onto him because he didn't do the correct. I, th I thought that was coming back. Ooh. Ooh. He has to figure out the plan. And I just want you to know he will be him at Ah, uh, we'll see. What's the Gemini? It's enough. It's enough. It's enough. It's the other gang that he killed the members of, right? Yeah. Mullet guy. <laughs> See, he wearing spurs? I think he's wearing spurs, yeah. <laughs> uh oh, is he gonna kill him? Oh dear. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh dear. Now he has to become. He's gonna have to go work for him for the protection. No. God ah, damn. That's always a good sign. When your episode's coming to an end and you don't want it to end. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Because uh, <laughs> it went by fast. It did go by it fast. It went by very fast. Uh, well, a lot happened. Um, what did you think about this episode? Uh, that was great. Yeah, picked up right where we left off. It started to really unfold more of the of the story. Uh, off as a central character. Yep, great, great development of the story. Great development of the characters. 
all the casting and the acting is just really, really good. Um, everybody's listening to each other and being very believable. It's it's fun. It's funny. The proverbial shit is about to hit the fan. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah. If it hasn't already, well, obviously. We got a huge, you know, not plot twist per se, but definitely a change in the fact that the 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 dad of the one Adarsh, gang is Adarsh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Yeah, Adarsh's dad. He's bleeding which out of the puts, head pretty heavily. Which puts him in charge. Even if he's not dead, I'm sure he's in a coma, which puts him in charge. Yeah. And now Raj Kumar is probably going to go back there because he wants the protection. Mm -hmm. She's going to be very happy about that because now he's going to be a man of means in her eyes. <laughs> so strange. Because <laughs> she seems like this like nice... <coughs> There's more going on to her. I don't think it's just that yeah. she wants money or power. It has to be something else because... She talked about his dad specifically. Yeah, she knows his dad. So what? what's going on there? Yeah, I don't know. Why is she so turned on the fact that he killed these two people? Right, right. That's what it seemed like. It seemed, it seemed and, like she was uh, turned on. Uh, Dulkar, his character, he had a lot of really nice moments of just stillness and listening. And, and um, you know, his character... They're all going to be... Has, everybody's got... Everybody's got a thing. A thing on now, somebody. Like... Um, Adar Ad Adarsh uh, now has to find out a plan, even though he probably wasn't ready or wanted to take over the business. Right. He's going to die if he doesn't. Right. So, uh, Dulker is going to have to probably be compromised in his, at least, he, justice morals. At least with whoever it is, because he just was on the phone saying, I'll meet. Who's he going to meet with? Yeah. Uh, and then, obviously, Raj Kumar now, either he needs protection or he's just going to get or he's revenge. Gonna yeah it's just gonna become he's gonna hide and, and give revenge and become become his own thing or he runs away there's so much going on that's interesting that's why i didn't want the episode to end and it's just so well shot the cinematography the 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 lighting choices sound yeah. design was really nice there was that one continuity thing where i'm pretty sure they were different camera setups but they maintained the sound of the motorcycle properly and the sound of the peacocks making their sound. Post, yeah. yeah, I mean, regardless, whatever they did, they yeah. made sure. Because there's a lot that's done, not just visually with like color correction and stuff, but there's a lot of stuff that's done in post unless you're Christopher Nolan. You know what? Christopher Nolan doesn't do ADR. <laughs> At all? If he, if he does it, it's very, very rare. RDJ was talking about it and saying that, it, and and I I saw other articles about the fact that it's very seldom. And if you miss any of the lines in, for example, Oppenheimer, it's because if he doesn't catch it on the day, he usually doesn't make any changes unless he absolutely has to because he just doesn't like adding the artificial entrance point of it. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Nice. RDJ said he's never encountered a director that just doesn't have any ADR when he's done rapping because. Everything you do, there's always going to be some ADR following filming. Always. At least a day. I'm sad that uh, Sunil's character, Gush. I know, Gutham, I enjoyed him. I, I was enjoying his relationship with Raj Kumar. I liked him as a, as a performer. And so, <laughs> it's sad when they kind of just... It's already going to feel that way because there's uniformity in the casting that's so strong. Who, Everybody's very, very good. Who is the villain? Have, have we got a name yet? I don't. Re I don't think we've seen Damn. the character name. Yes, it, it's it's Gulshan is the actor. Gulshan, but I don't okay. think we have a character name uh, for him as of yet. I like how I like how cliche all of his villainness is. Oh yeah, the gold tooth. <laughs> it definitely sounded like he was wearing spurs. Spurs. <laughs> Please which, let that be a which is obviously a character a tip thing. Of the cap to not only uh, uh, westerns in Hollywood, but we heard it in Cholet and other. Yeah. Westerns of the day. It's, of, it's a great, in. great ad. Fring, fring, it's a cool fring. sound, and it's a really great ad to have for for the killer. Uh, yeah, they're clearly adding a lot to the to that. Now I, I want to know more because I'm like, it seems like a he has a little shtick, the how he kills people and yeah. different things like that. I'm I'm so interested. Um, it's it goes to Raj and DK and how talented they are. They just know how to make compelling. Um, stories mm -hmm. and different because this is nothing like Farsi. This is nothing like Family Man. Uh, nothing like nothing it. like Street. <laughs> well, they were just producers on Street. Yeah, I know, but still. Yeah, um, and they were producers on um, Cinema Bandi as well. 
uh, and they were directors well, on Which Ghost isn't a surprise, because they said, I mean, if there's one thing I think we can expect from them for their careers is going to be the fact that they're just never going to repeat things because it gets boring for them. They want to be challenged. They want to go into new things. They want to try some different things. It's super interesting how different directors do things, right? Because yeah. certain directors have a style. And like to stick in the style. Nolan yeah. has a style. He does. And not that his films are all the same, but he you're like, this feels like a Nolan film. Right. Um, what's his face from um, Munabai, the director that's directing Donkey. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Definitely. He has, has a style a, to his films. A style. Yeah, that he 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 likes to. Gerwig through. has style to her her films. That's very much um, now. You can tell it's a Greta Gerwig film. That's more in just the the quirkiness because all of her films are actually quite different. They're they're, they're definitely Lady different. Bird, but uh, Little Women. But she has a similarity in the fact that she really messaging is very important for her and her storytelling. Yeah, for sure. Very important. But then her. you have directors like Raj and Ike and, and many others, obviously, that they're like, I don't want to do right any. Anywhere near, yeah. Don't box, don't in, box in, me in. I don't want you to be, look at him and be like, "That's so and so." Exactly. Like Martin Scorsese, I can't cut anything in my film, so he has four-hour films all the time. Or even stylistically, <laughs> and there, it's just it's the difference between people. I don't find anything right or wrong. No, no, and no, I know no. you don't either. No, no, no. Nothing right or wrong with it, but that's the one thing about them is that it's a it's a it's a plus, I think, in that anything they do, you're always going to have that sense of what's next. Yeah. What is this? I want to. So, obviously, we're going to watch the other episodes, um, but I'm intrigued. Um, every episode has a little cliffhanger, yeah, on it of like, oh, what's going to happen now? Which is what you want at the end of every episode. Uh, I've also found the the funniness to be a bit more uh, to the chest, not not as outright. There's been a yeah. lot of there's little one liners, little throwaways, little wink wink nudge nudges that are really funny. A lot of uh, I'm wondering how Indians will take this series, um, in terms of because there's a lot of I feel Western influence in the it, obviously in the in the score. If those songs don't mean as much to you as yeah, like wait, if they play they and they have old Hindi songs and old old uh, songs like that. And yeah, I know what that mean. But like these songs, we're like if you hear this, you're like. <laughs> That's hilarious. You're but, using that song. I know what you're trying to imply here. I, I have found, both in personal experience with messages and those I know that are from India, and especially with, with my wife, the first thing that shocked me about Indrani when I got to know her was how inundated her life had been from childhood with the exact same shows and songs that I had. Mm. So I, I would think that the majority of Indians who grew up in any of the big cities were exposed to and loved. They're far more aware of and impacted by American culture than Americans are by Indian culture. I so I, if it, it goes to these old songs that they've been using, and that's been a theme. Yeah, the first one, it was "I'll Be Waiting," and then this one was uh, whatever yeah. this one was. And now, uh, so I'm 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 expecting now every episode to have like an old uh, English yeah I think love song I and, and I I think it's as prevalent in countless hundreds of millions of Indians as it is in Raj and DK and my wife who yeah. and many stupid babies I talk to who just they know and love so much of what's come out of American art and culture for so long that I think the majority of them are going to know this yeah. stuff. Yeah. Anyways, I'm enjoying it. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. If you uh, saw this on YouTube, obviously you saw a very cut up version of uh, five, 10 minutes because of copyright reasons. You can go watch it on Netflix, obviously. Yep. This is not sponsored or anything. Um, but if you like to see the full uncut versions, you can head over to Patreon. I'll put a link in the description below and the pinned comment so you can go check that out. And on to the next episode.